Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is April Cherie, if you are new. Today I'm gonna to be doing a makeup look using some items from the Peanuts Time Wet n Wild collection that I purchased from Walmart. So we're gonna just jump right into the video. I'm gonna show you guys quickly what I purchased. So we're gonna just jump right into the video. Um, let's get started with the main thing is the palette. I got the Peanuts Time Wet n Wild um, this is the, what is this? The Merry Christmas Charlie Brown palette. There are 15 shades total in this palette. And I think this palette is really pretty and very festive for the holidays. So it looks like that. Very pretty shades. I also purchased the, this is the quad, the face quad, um, the gift of giving palette. And there are two blushes here and then I have two highlights over here very pretty I also got the two lipsticks that they had this one is Charlie Brown it is of course a brown shade looks like this super pretty perfect for every day and then I got the Santa Snoopy lipstick, and it is a red lipstick. I think there's some glitter in here too, it looks like. Let me do a little swatch. Ooh, pretty. I'll do a swatch of the Charlie Brown one too. That's super pretty. I also got the Good Grief um, Waterproof Eyeliner. I got this. I love Wet n Wild packaging. It's very festive and pretty. They always have beautiful like collections, like collabs and stuff. And let's do a swatch. That's just a little one little swatch. Let's do two. It's pretty buildable, so it looks like that. I also got the Merry Marshmallow. This is a lip mask. So with the lip mask, you can leave this overnight. But for me, when, when I'm going to do um, my eye look, I'm going to just put this on prior to doing starting my makeup look so that my lips can just get ready for the lipstick. So it looks like this. And the last thing that I got from the collection is the Season of Snoopy four piece makeup brushes. So with this, you get a face brush, like a powder brush here. Let me open it so you guys can see it, get a better, better look. So you get a powder brush here. You get the contour, this can be a contour or like a, a a blush brush, you get an eyeshadow brush, and then you get the creased brush right there. So you get four brushes, and that's pretty much everything that I got in the collection. So I'm gonna just jump right in and get started with the makeup look. Um, I'm gonna put this Merry Marshmallow on my lips right now to kind of just have my eye, my lips, um, you know, soft and ready for when I'm done with my look. Smells really good. I'm just gonna put some of this on. And I and I feel like with the lip mask, you can pretty much leave it overnight, like I said, or you can just have it just prepping your lips for your lip color that you're gonna do while you're doing your makeup. So that's a plus with lip mask. So I'm gonna go ahead and prime my eyes and then we're gonna get started and create a festive, you know, look. I'm going to prime my eyes using the Juvia's Place Eye Prep Eye Primer. It's in the shade 2. And I like to give this a good shake before putting this on. I'm going to go ahead and put this onto my eyes, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I have my eyes primed now, so what I'm going to start is I'm going to start with this shade down here. This is the Charlie Brownest, Brownest. Um, shade and I'm gonna 
take some of this brown shade and start putting this into the crease. I'm gonna take this shade next to the um, that brown shade. This is good green. I'm gonna take that dark blue shade and I'm gonna put it on the outer corner of my eye. That blue shade. I know a lot of people kind of gave this palette a little bit of haze, but um, we're gonna just work with what we have. I always like to do the placement first and then we start working our way into how we want or where we want this. So we like to do the placement first. I'm gonna take the eyeshadow brush, super pretty. Look at the details, cute. So I'm gonna take this eyeshadow brush and then I'm gonna go ahead and use the this glittery blue shade. I'm gonna use this shade right here. This one I believe is called Christmas Queen. So we're gonna use Christmas Queen on our lid. And I'm gonna take this shade here. This one is ice skating. I'm gonna take ice skating right there. I'm gonna put that in the inner corner of my eye. I'm gonna get my concealer. I'm gonna conceal and all that. And then we're gonna get into this palette right here. So I'll be right back. I'm just gonna conceal and put some lashes on. And I'll be right back to do the blush and highlight. The lashes I'm going to use are these lashes right here from Kiss. They're pompadour. I feel like they're just more fuller for the look. Okay, so I finished my eye makeup. I put the lashes on the pompadour Kiss lashes. And then I added mascara um, on my bottom lashes. This is the mascara I used. On my bottom lashes I really like this one for my bottom because just the way the bristles are they're very like tiny and they really get my finer lashes and yeah so now I'm gonna go and do my blush using the quad um, the face quad palette and I'm gonna use this shade here for my blush so let me take this like I said this can be a contour or a blush brush I'm gonna use it as blush and I'm gonna take that shade up there. They don't have any names, I don't think. Oh yeah, they do. So I think this one, it, that one's called Golden Retrievers. So I'm gonna use that shade. And also too, I added the 
under my lid, I added the ice skating um, under my lid, the um, shade on my lower lid. So I'm gonna put this on my blush. I mean, I'm gonna put this on my cheeks. Move my hair. Really pretty. Super pigmented. I think this is really pretty. Give me a really nice um, color. Not too much. And I always work my blush like up, like I would contour, but I like to work my blush up there as well. And on my cheeks. And a little bit on my nose. And I like to do a little bit on my forehead and some on my chin. Just kind of like the excess I put on my um, my chin and forehead. So I think this really gave me a lot of color back into my face. Um, now we're gonna go with the highlight. I think the highlight shade I want to use is possibly this one. I'm gonna do a little swatch. So it's pretty like fair, like I don't really, that's what it looks like. Just a little glow, let's see this gold one. Ooh, this one's pretty. So we go with the gold, we're gonna go with the gold one. So I'm gonna get my highlight brush. I'm gonna take that one and that one is called Christmas Cookie. So hold on, wait. It's Golden Retrievers. So okay, so I'm sorry. So the blush that I used was called Christmas Cookie because this one down here is called Schmack, I guess. Like a snack, but it's snack. Okay, and then this one is it's Golden Retrievers, and then this one. Is icy glow. So this one's golden retriever. So I had the blush and the highlight name mix. So I'm gonna twirl this in here. I want a nice highlight. Ooh, so pretty. That's a beautiful highlight. I think ooh, this is so This is pretty. This is super pigmented. Wow. Wow, that highlight is really nice, wet and wild. So let me just, so you guys are not confused, this one is, it's Golden Retrievers, and this one's cook, Christmas Cookie. Okay, so I had them like mixed up with the name. Okay, super pretty. And I also have the Shake It Like a Snow Globe spray. I don't think I showed you guys this in the beginning. I also have this one too. So, I have the, um, what is this? The lip mask on, I'm gonna wipe it off. My lips do feel pretty soft. So, for lipstick, I'm not sure if I want to do the red or the brown. I think I want to try this this red. I think this red is really pretty. So I think I'm going to do the red lipstick instead because I think it's cute and I want something colorful. So I'm going to do this the Santa Snoopy lip color. Do I like it with this eye look? Yes, but I feel like this is a lot of brightness, but this is what the red one looks like. And I'm gonna go put the other one on, the Charlie Brown one. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I changed my lips. This is the um, the brown shade. This is the Charlie Brown shade. And I like this one. This is giving me a lot of like 90s grunge type of lipstick feel, but I think it goes good with the eyes because the red was a bit like, I need my eyes more toned down. 
But I already set my face using this and this smells so freaking good you guys. This smells really good and there are like glitter sparkles in here. But this is the full look um, of using the Wet n Wild peanuts collection. I think it looks really good. I really do like the blue shades. I'm going to play more and do another look using some of the other shades in here because there's like a variety of different shades. Like you could do a really beautiful pink look with this. These two look at this beautiful green as well. Like they're look at that color. Look at that. So these swatch really nice in my opinion. Um, but yeah, I feel like I need to play more in the palette because there's like a variety of colors to choose from. But overall, I really do enjoy the collection. Um, for the eye pencil, I just kind of, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I just filled in some of my molds with the pencil. Um, but, cause usually I'll just line a little bit on the top, but not too much. But um, I just did some of my like little molds and I think the liner is really nice. Um, everything's pretty affordable. I think the eyeshadow palette, you should give it a try. They're very pigmented in my opinion. And yeah, I liked everything um, out of the collection of what I purchased. Um, I wish I got my hands on some of the nail polishes that I saw um, on the website, but I didn't see it in store for myself. But um, if you guys don't have any of these items, I really highly suggest getting the eyeshadow palette and also the the eyeshadow palette I recommend you getting and then this uh, quad face palette highly recommend you getting um, if you're gonna get anything out of the collection and also the fa the facial spray I mean you don't need to get it but it's really nice it smells really good and it sets your face so the eyeshadow palette and the quad facial palette these are something that I recommend you guys get if you're gonna get something out of the collection I say get these two items um, and the, I like this lip as well. It's a bit more deeper than what I thought. I thought it would be more of a terracotta, lightish brown color. But this is like a true like brown brown shade. But um, but yeah, it's like a true brown shade. But everything is really nice. Um, I like the overall look. Um, I really like that red lipstick. But I just feel like I need to wear some type of neutral eyeshadow to kind of pull it off because. The blue eyes and red lips are like, it's a lot, it's a lot going on. It could be pulled off, but I thought it was a bit much. And I also really did enjoy this highlighter. This one was super pigmented, in my opinion. So this highlighter was extremely pigmented. This one was not as pigmented as I was hoping it would be, but it, you know, if you are more of a fair skin, it would work off, but I just feel like it's very like faint compared to that one I don't know so thank you all so much for watching and if you're not please subscribe I would truly appreciate it and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up thank you guys bye